welcome back to our YouTube channel and in today's video we are going to be looking at the change of subject of formula and on this place we are going to make um, the uh, subject to stand alone that is what we are going to learn today and if today is the first time of watching our channel please can do us like subscribe share to your loved ones okay in this, in this time we solve mathematics questions based on, on different topics and different textbooks so please okay Kindly subscribe and like you will enjoy this our channel okay okay we go to number one question we say we should make on p equals to um square root of 5 t over d and we should make d the subject of formula which means that we should make d or uh, d or uh, the subject stand alone so what i'm going what i'm going to do here now is very simple okay since you have a square root what happened i'll take square of both sides so if I take square of both sides, definitely this square root will go off, which means that take square root of both sides, take square of both sides, sorry, take square of both sides, of both sides, which means that p square, remember that's written, p square equals to square root of 5t over t. So take square of it also, because the operation you perform in the, in the final expression should be on both sides. Which is this and this. So mean that p square means what on p is power to minus p square equals to square cancel square is out. We have what five t over d. The next is what I cross multiply. Okay, cross multiply. I will take it step by step so as we get it clearly. Cross multiply, which means that p square multiply what d equals to what five t. Which means what p square d equals to 5t. So this is actually what we should do what we should make d the what solid of formula to start in one. Definitely, I will divide both sides by what by p square, which means divide both sides, divide both sides by p square, which means p square d over p square equals to 5t over p square so p square cancel p square is gone we have what d equals to what 5t over p square so this is my final answer it's very simple do you see that it's very simple okay